Hello and welcome to my first YouTube video in which I'll be showing you how to make shrimp and mussel boil with butter sauce. I'm going to be making this dish for two people and I'm going to start off by adding a few of these baby red potatoes, some raw colossal shrimp, corn, this bag of cooked mussels, and last but not least, sausage. So I'm going to start off by filling a pot full of water and bringing that to a boil. While I'm waiting for my water to boil, I am going to clean my potatoes, scrub them to make sure that they're squeaky clean. Since I am making this dish for two people, I am only going to wash about 12 baby potatoes um, since we have a lot of other food to eat. I don't want anything to go to waste. So I think... 12 potatoes is enough for us but of course you can add as many potatoes as you like it just depends you know how many people you're feeding how many potatoes you want to eat if you're a potato lover then you know whatever floats your boat so now that our potatoes are nice and clean we are going to add them to our boiling water give them a little stir and boil them for about 15 minutes until um, you can stick a fork through them so now that our potatoes are ready we are going to set them aside and keep the water boiling so that we can add our corn next but just before we add our corn, we are going to give them a little wash, then add them to the boiling water so that they can boil for about 10 minutes. Now that our corn is ready, we are going to transfer it to the side and move on to washing our mussels. Um, I am going to rinse the mussels until the water is crystal clear. Before adding our mussels to the boiling water, I am going to add a little bit of Old Bay seasoning so that it could give it a good taste. And once I've added all the mussels in, I'm going to boil for about 8 minutes. Now that our mussels are ready, we are going to add them to our dish and get started on cleaning our shrimp and adding them to the boiling water for about 3 to 5 minutes. So now that our shrimp is done, we are going to continue by cutting our sausage in thin slices. Um, I like to do my sausage different. I don't like to boil my sausage just because I feel that it gives it a very watery taste. So instead, how I like to cook it is by... Uh, heating up a little bit of butter and then frying the sausage in the butter and that gives it a really delicious buttery taste. While I'm frying my sausage, I like to get started on making my butter sauce. But this is uh, how your sausage should look like once it's finished frying um, and once it's frying you set it aside and then your meal should be ready but um, I'm going to show you how to make the butter sauce next. To make my butter sauce, what you're going to need is Cajun seasoning, Old Bay seasoning, brown sugar, onion powder, garlic salt, butter, a whole onion, lemon pepper, minced garlic, paprika, and black pepper. 
To start this butter sauce, I am going to start by dicing a whole onion and I like to dice my onion as thinly as possible and while I'm dicing it I already have a skillet on the stove with a little bit of butter so that once it's hot um, I can just go ahead throw in my onion and start sauteing it. So now that I have my onion in the skillet, I'm going to add a little bit of salt and two teaspoons of minced garlic. I'm going to mix well and saute until the onions are browned evenly. As I'm sauteing, I'm going to be adding a bit of butter here and there and I'm going to be sauteing my onions and garlic um, in a little bit less than medium heat. So once our onion and garlic are caramelized to perfection, I'm going to add one teaspoon of Cajun seasoning, one teaspoon of Old Bay seasoning, one teaspoon of onion powder, one teaspoon of paprika, one teaspoon of lemon pepper, one teaspoon of garlic salt, and one teaspoon of black pepper. Lastly, I'm going to add two teaspoons of brown sugar, then I'm going to mix all the spices together and here is where I'm going to start adding lots of butter. As I heat my sauce, I add more butter to my liking. Um, you can add, you can always add more or less butter, or add, you know, any of the spices that you like. I know a lot of people like to add spicy condiments, but I don't like my butter sauce spicy, so that is why I don't add chili flakes or any hot sauces because I like to keep it mild. But you know, you can always add any type of spice that you want, um, add more butter, add more onion, whatever you feel like your taste buds will be satisfied. But this is how I like it. I really, really recommend for you to try this because it is so delicious. So yeah, that is how I make my shrimp and mussel boil with butter sauce. I am really, really excited to be part of this YouTube community so if you feel like this is something you would like and would enjoy please subscribe and let me know in the comments below what type of videos you would like to see in my channel I'm going to try to focus on making like recipe videos um, and I don't know really what the future has in store for this channel but if you have any ideas please let me know and again, welcome to my channel.